Okay, well, we're on our usual grand team work on Saturday morning. Uh, we've only got half the team here because all the youngsters are up at Fortburn Road laying turf. That's the mostly the Duke of Edinburgh youngsters. There'll be 10 or 12 of them up there. And we're quite short of people today because uh, at least three or four have got other commitments. So what they're doing today is clearing up. I mean, sadly, we've had to cut trees down on here. Uh, we don't like to, but we have to when it's right in the line of the canal or when they're dangerous. And so we then end up with a load of wood. Now, in the past, we would have um, perhaps carted it away and burnt it somewhere. But what we're now doing, because it's so much better environmentally, is cutting it up and making habitat piles, which will get a bit of soil covering on them and are marvellous for attracting all the invertebrates, the bugs, the small mammals. And that anyway will help with increasing the bird life because they've got something to eat. So that's basically what we're doing, um, sorting, cutting the wood up, sorting it into chunky bits which go into habitat piles. The small stuff, which we've got right here, um, Steve will come along with his wonderful flail mower and he will basically mulch that all up and then that stays. And the benefit of all that is that we're also doing amazing carbon capture by burying the wood which will rot down and um, failing the, the small stuff. What we have here and what folks are using, the trolley and oh, probably about 10 sets of loppers, some bow saws, we've got small um, little folding saws, this trolley, uh, a few helmets, some secateurs, some shears, some rakes, have all been bought with a TSB community fund grant that we got almost exactly a year ago for a thousand pounds. Oh yes, and because we have so many youngsters working for us now on either Queenscroft or the Duke of Edinburgh's, and we make them take brambles out and hawthorn hedges that get cut. They needed good gloves. So we also now have about 20 pairs of good leather gloves of various sizes, which means that, you know, we're not, um, we're not requiring our youngsters particularly to bring their own kit. So thank you TSB Community Fund.